Okay guys, here is the Chris Hemsworth haircut from the movie Extraction, which I did see, which was an awesome film. I mean, he did a, a really incredible job in it. So let's break down the haircut. I use the number one up to about right here. And this is probably the focal point of the haircut. Everybody probably wants to know how to get these pieces, which I'll explain. But what I did do is a number one, and then, a, and then I raised the lever, so it's kind of a one and a half right into here. So it wasn't just a harsh line, even though it does kind of appear that way in the film. And I extended that all the way throughout the other side, as you can see into here. And I want to keep in mind that this is the highlight of the haircut, right? These longer pieces. Also keep in mind, his hair was very wet a lot of the time from sweating and just the action and all that. So it's going to look very, very different. And I'll kind of, I'll actually show you what it looks like when it's a little more wet so you can see. But I did blow dry this uh, to get this result. And then I used my Tidal Wave Sea Salt Spray. The back is probably about, I'd say, an inch and a half to two inches. And I did go gradually going shorter to longer in throughout the front. Because again, I wanted to make this longer. I did that by over directing, meaning every section as I got towards the front, I brought this slightly back so it fell forward, having a little more length. And then on this side, what I did is I created a haircut where it wasn't, it's not a solid disconnection. It's slightly blended right in through here. But as you can see, this part is, has to be left out for it to go over this way. And you can see that it's clear in a lot of the pictures in the, uh, you know, in the, in the film itself. You know, it looks like it's a disconnected part, but it's literally just like this, where it's all blended in here. And then this is a bit disconnected right in throughout the front. And blow dried it all forward. And here we have the finished result. So let's go in with a little bit of water like this so you can see and just say this is after you know sweating and, and all the action and stuff like that I mean this is a lot of how in the film his hair was so when you when you wet the hair look what happens it automatically creates a little bit of separation and uh, and pieciness and texture so a lot of times if he's in a battle scene or in, in an action scene you know the hair will come down like this and that's, that's where you're getting those pieces coming down into here. How long do they have to be? I'd say no longer than this right into here. You definitely don't want to cut it too short. You need to have some sort of length so it does go over and come around, just like you see in, uh, in a lot of the photos where this piece just almost kind of hangs over the rest of it. But when you brush it back, it's kind of camouflaged like that. So I had a lot of fun doing this. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I watched the film. Let me know if you watched it. It was really awesome. Chris Hemsworth is like, no wonder he, he's an A-lister. I mean, he's so talented and so good. And it was nice to see. I mean, <laughs> he was like a one-man show almost. I mean, this guy was a powerhouse. Let me know what you think about the haircut here. Uh, again, I think it's uh, pretty much almost exactly like how his hair is in the movie. Don't, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay safe. And I'll see you next time for more videos with a salon guy.